Anatomy and Physiology for the Beauty Industry, the Endocrine System. The endocrine system balances your hormone levels through gland secretions and keeps your body's systems running smoothly. The main gland is the pituitary and it works closely with the hypothalamus to keep the balance. Imbalances are common and can be picked up through blood tests. In our industry, we may notice endocrine system imbalances through skin and hair disorders. Therefore, it's very important to understand the principles of this system. What are hormones? Hormones are chemical messengers which are secreted by your endocrine glands via the bloodstream to target specific systems of the body. Pituitary gland. Your endocrine system consists of the following glands. Pituitary. This is a pea-sized gland in the base of the brain which helps with homeostasis through a variety of hormones. From the front of the pituitary, it secretes growth hormones relating to bone and muscle development, thyroid stimulating hormone to control thyroxin within the thyroid gland, prolactin to stimulate milk production in pregnancy, adrenal corticotrophic hormone relating to the adrenal glands, luteinizing hormone to control sex hormones, ovaries and testes, follicle stimulating hormone to control the production of eggs and sperm. From the back of the pituitary it secretes antidiuretic hormone to control urine production, oxytocin which stimulates uterine contractions within labour. Thyroid gland. This is situated in the neck and produces thyroxin which controls chemical reactions in the cells. Over and underactive thyroids are very common and can be treated with medication or full or partial removal of the thyroid gland. Parathyroid gland. This gland is divided into four sections, two on each side behind the thyroid and it looks like a bow tie. It secretes parathormone which controls calcium levels. Thymus gland. This lies in the chest cavity and is believed to secrete the hormones related to controlling sex organ development. It is connected to immunity development in childhood and secretes thymosin, shrinking as we develop into adults. Hypothalamus gland. This is in the brain just above the pituitary. It links the endocrine and nervous systems by maintaining homeostasis and supporting the pituitary. When the pituitary releases a hormone, the hypothalamus will release its own hormone to support and regulate this. As it is connected to the nervous system, it has influence over deciding which hormones should be secreted to maintain a healthy balance. Pineal gland. This is in the brain and helps to regulate the pituitary gland. It is believed to be involved in the production of melatonin which regulates sleep. Adrenal glands. These are the glands that sit above each kidney and secrete adrenaline, your fight or flight hormone. It has a very noticeable effect on the body's systems by increasing heartbeat, dilating pupils, quickening breathing and more to help you decide whether to stay or flee from a situation. Cortisol is secreted here to control glucose use and aldosterone is produced to control blood pressure and salt balance. Sex glands. Ovaries in females produce oestrogen which controls the feminine characteristics of the body, breasts, softer skin etc. Testes in males produce testosterone which controls the male characteristics of the body, lower voice, body hair etc. Islets of Langerhans. These are situated in the pancreas and are a cluster of cells which secrete insulin to regulate sugar levels when they are too high and glucogen when blood sugar is too low.